What is going on guys? Welcome back. Um, I'm going to be covering the mod files for American Truck Simulator and these applies for our Euro truck. So I downloaded all the different files and the easiest one is the SES file. Everybody knows that you have to have the SES at the very end of it. So you know that's all you need. Copy it and just copy it or drag it into your mods folder okay so that's it for that so when you have this one this one's basically your zip file um, just have it extracted and basically when you see the seven file you do know that you have to extract it okay um, once you extract it, you will have your SES files. Usually, you have either one or you know several. In this case, we have three. Same thing. Just copy it or drag it on into your mods file, uh, mods folder. So there's that. There, that's it for that. Okay. Now, probably when it gets a little more complicated is when you come across these uh, this zip files. Okay. And a lot of people have been, they've been having problems with this one, for example, the Pinga one, okay? So, so this is what happens. Sometimes you have to extract it and sometimes you don't. And the only way you find out for that, you know, just, just go ahead and extract it. And once you have all these files, when you have all these, that means you know you don't have to extract the file, Okay. So when you have when you see vehicle template material def especially this one I don't know I just instantly when I see this one I already know you don't need to extract the file okay just get rid of that and just have your zip file copied or dragged into your mods folder okay so that's it for that oh for God's sakes. Okay, so here's another example. Extract it. And you know this one you do not need to extract. Okay? So just get rid of all that. Copy this one into your mods folder. And you're done. Then, let's extract this one. And you have SES files. That's when you know, excuse me, that's when you know you have to extract this kind of file, extract it, copy it over to your mods folder. And that is it. You are done. And hopefully this video helped. I will see you guys on the next one. Peace.